tell me about your brother. Uh, he's a New York City firefighter, uh, stationed at uh, Ladder 156 in Brooklyn. And he uh, responded that day, 9-11, and uh, he worked there for, uh, I think for weeks. And, uh, put a lot of time in. Unfortunately, uh, eight years later, he came down, he had some pain and had a diagnosis of cancer. Due to him working down at the 9/11, and uh, doctors confirmed he was exposed to over toxins, and uh, he passed away. He lasted about a year from his diagnosis, and uh, he passed away in 2000, October 2009. And, uh, I guess he served. He was actually a transit worker. For 10 years, the transit. Before he became a firefighter. Yes, he worked in maintenance away. Uh, as a plumber, plumbers. And uh, he owned the fire department, I believe, it was in uh, 1997. And like I said, he passed away in, uh, uh, in 2009, October. So it was a great loss to my family and his friends and everybody I knew. He was a great guy. And uh, my co workers uh, put a little theme on this truck and presented it to me yesterday. And uh, it's really uh, an honor. The only thing holding this go-kart together was rust. So we bought it because we were one of the worst go-karts in the shop. So we decided to start with this one. So we tore it completely apart, gutted everything from the chassis all the way up. Put all the sheet metal, uh, diamond plate, everything. Welded it, painted it, and uh, all the electrical wire and all the uh, electrical components, everything, and put all the options in. All the artwork, the paint, and uh, and uh, I was really uh, surprised. Uh, <laughs> well, you know, weren't surprised about the car. You were surprised, surprised with the, the artwork. Car. The steel diamond plate, uh, the aluminum diamond plate in front, it looked like Iron Man with the headlights. So we dubbed this Iron Man. And then next yeah, thing you know, we, we decided to give the hand, this, hand it over to George over here. And with his brother, we, we basically retained a lot of the equipment around the shop. And these are very uh, essential to uh, the job, getting the work done. Come in handy, and uh, just without mm -hmm. them, the work would take yeah, a lot it's longer. It's a real big facility, so you need to get around. Yeah, it'll be help. Yeah, yeah. I mean, pretty much uh, with George, I think he'll take care of for another 20 years. I'll come here.